Hey beautiful Virgo, welcome in to the Gifted Hermit. I hope you're doing oh so well. If you're new to the channel, my name is Leela. I reside in London, UK, baby. And I'm also a Virgo. It's a Virgo gang. It's a Virgo vibe. Okay, let, what we're going to do today is see what the month of May has to offer for us, Virgo. In terms of work, life and... Uh, sorry. In, time, in, in terms of home life, like just generally what's going on in life in terms of work and of course in terms of love, baby. Right, so for the month of May 2024, please guide us with regards to Virgo. How is finances and career looking? How is work looking for the month of May 2024 for Virgo? Work 2024 for May. Okay, so we have the Death card and we have the Three of Swords. One more card with regards to work for May 2024 for Virgo. Okay, so have you ever got that feeling where you know it's like a new chapter for you with regards to work? Now, that's not to say... I'm going to leave my job. For some of you guys, maybe. Okay, I see big changes here. A very transitional card. A rebirth. The past is now the past. And we're stepping into the future with the three of wands. There's stuff that you need to do. Perhaps, um, what, stuff that you need to do is stuff that you want to do, Virgo. Yeah? You're ready to surf the waves. You're ready to go through a next journey in your life with regards to work now maybe you have a project in mind a new business adventure you've been thinking about other stuff that you want to kind of tip your toes in and see what that could bring four of pentacles is about security it's about how generous you are so for example like one thing that i've always wanted to do is foster care um, my children are teenagers now and I like to look to the future and plan being a Virgo that I am and I was thinking I was saying to my friend today look in five ten years time my children are going to be adults and you know they're probably gonna start to live their own lives what does my next chapter bring and foster care has definitely been one of those things four of pentacles is a very generous energy but it's also the importance to have security and stability in your life okay and finding that balance four of pentacles could be saving for something maybe you're saving for something maybe you know what that is maybe you're not quite sure yet but saving is important and some of you guys are doing it already so big changes here with regards to work life and new chapters okay some of you guys may get promoted um into something new with regards to those staying in work so let's move on to life for may 2024 so we have the seven of swords we also have the eight ace of swords and the ten of pentacles so with regards to life, let's start with the Seven of Swords. There may be some sort of secret that's going to be revealed to you in the month of May around life, okay? Um, you'll find out something that perhaps you didn't know before. There's going to be a lot of tea, maybe. Seven of Swords can also be a warning of someone that's going to betray you or someone that's going to lie or deceive you in some way or Virgo. So be mindful that all of that. It could be something really small, you know, like, uh, you know, chit chat, you know, Chinese whispers, or it could be something a bit more. But um, honestly, I don't really think you give a shit. With the Ace of Swords, this talks about success here. There's going to be some success with finances. I would say, why not do the lottery this month if you don't usually do that? It may be a very lucky month for some of you guys with regards to the lottery. Uh, finances, abundance here. The Ace of Swords is about intelligence. It's about intellect, ideas, clarity. There's going to be some sort of clarity in the month of May um but you you're going to be victorious in some areas of your life your state of awareness is going to be heightened and your consciousness also you're going to get for some of you guys an aha moment aha so it's nice 
and, and you're a genius, most of you guys, okay? So expect brilliant moments, brilliant moments of clarities and things falling into place for you for the month of May. Um, Ten of Pentacles, again, this is all about family, community, abundance, prosperity, leaving a legacy behind Virgo, you know, um, for generations to come. Building your legacy, working on your spirituality. You are definitely in um, in line with coming to get some sort of success here. Some sort of wealth. Oh baby, it's a big one. So, for the month of May, we're going to talk about love for Virgo for the month of May 2024. Okay. Starting off with a very positive card, the Sun card, the Yes card. May 2024, Love for Virgo. Justice. Love for 2024, May for Virgo. May 2024, for Love for Virgo. Wow, the lover's card. So there is, wow, well, we've got the chariot card on the bottom of the deck, which can also indicate success, um, cancer energy, dynamics here. But yeah, we have uh, we have Leo energy here with regards to love, as well as Libra and Gemini. It doesn't have to be these signs, but the sun card indicates some sort of success here, some sort of happiness, happiness in the domain of love. And not only that, positive communication and justice. This is about not only standing up for yourself, but standing your ground. Truth, honesty, honesty with regards to love, harmonious relationships here. For some of you guys, this is a very deep connection. So it looks very promising. So what I'm going to do is pull out some oracle cards for the month of May. For the month of May 2024 for Virgo. The Eight of Pentacles. Virgo, take great pride in your excellent work. Practice makes perfect. Consider getting additional education or training. Oracle message for May 2024 for Virgo. The Three of Swords. Release the past. You will grow from the situation. Time heals all wounds. For May 2024 for Virgo. What is the Oracle message for Virgo for 2024 May? new beginnings starting a new life virgo finding your purpose a forgiving and compassionate review of the past and i'm gonna get two more cards for virgo may 2024 perspective there's a better way pause for reflection and insight dare to be different these oracle messages are very positive. And the last card, Virgo, the magician card, okay? You can manifest the life you want. What you need will magically appear. Successful beginnings. So, my dears, I hope you enjoyed that reading for the month of May. I did. <laughs> Um, you can book me for a personal reading. Just get in touch. You can also follow me on the socials I follow back and catch me for live tarot. As I always say, from one borough girl to another, be kind to others, but most importantly, be kind to you and the gifted will catch you on the rebound. Take care, my loves. Mwah.